hello again this is abm graphics and welcome back to the week today is monday yes we are just getting end of the month and i know a whole lot of people are working out yes today i just want to take you through on something uh, but not different but just in photoshop how to design a banner yes a simple banner for a client and it's going to be something beautiful so let's just go to our photoshop and let's get it done so first of all we are going to our photoshop and this is my photoshop that i already launched and you can see i'm using photoshop cc 2019 version yes you know so the first thing i have to do is to create a new background and to create a new document yes and this particular document i don't have a specific back uh, this thing because that is not just for i'm doing it for a client but just for you to get understand of how to design some kind of simple banner for your client so first of all just create my new this thing and over here i'll choose the photoshop default size just like this then i'll click ok you get that yes so in this particular case i can't use the whole of this thing it's too big for me because i want it to be somehow simple and what i need to do is that i just want to crop up of this particular background so i'll come and pick my crop tool over here and then i'll just move this one over there just like that okay just like that and i think this this way will be okay for me and then i'll click okay and then i'll have it like this you get that yes and i have a resources that i'm going to use and i'll put down in below the description and so that you can download everything yes on that so first of all i just have to create my background by group so i'll group it call it bg i'll call it bg that's my background and then the the, the the next thing i have to do is to create a gradient color by coming so that i'll come and i'll create a background i'll create a background for that and i'll come and click on the uh, adjustment layer over here then i'll come and select gradient over there and then i'll just come and click over here then this particular uh gradient i'll just pick this particular gradient over there then i'll click okay but the next thing i have to do is that the style over here i'll change it to radial and i'll have it like this you get that and the next thing i have to do is that the angle i'll change it to minus 4.5 yes and i can have it like this and for my this thing i'll just use my uh, mouse and drag it somewhere here it just like that and it will be okay for me then i'll click okay you get that yes and the next thing i have to do is to go and import in another background that i've just downloaded from the internet and i'll just pick that background just this background background and then i'll right click on it then i'll rotate it 90 clockwise just like this and the next thing i have to do is to just uh, move it just like so that it will fill up that particular background just like that you get that yes and the next thing i have to do is to change the blinding mode to what to overlay then i'll have it like this like this you get that then i'll click ok and that to this now just select all and then i'll put it in the background and this will be my background you get that yes and the next thing i have to do is to go and import in that images that i'm going to use and these are the images that i'm going to use so first of all just go and import in this particular image this particular uh, shoe and should be here you get that and this particular arrangement the composition will be very simple and it won't have a whole lot of issues on that then i'll import in this one too and for this one i'll just transform it down just down just like this okay yes and then the next thing that i have to import in again is this shoe and that particular shoe there is it's already shoe uh, over there but i just want to fill up that shoe with this particular shoe you get that and the next thing i have to do is to come and pick up the shisha this thing over here and that one i'll just let it be somewhere here you get that yes and i'll move it somewhere here and should be somewhere here and that one should be somehow close to this one so that it will be in line you get that yes and then i'll just save my work so that i won't get problem at the end of the day so call it banner yes and i'll just call it band okay and then this is what i have then i'll move this one somewhere here so that uh, it won't have it won't take much of space and then i'll have this one too over here just like that and the next thing i have to do is to come over and pick and open up my distance over here the information here then i'll pick up this particular distance and i'll pick that queen that i'm doing it for that particular uh, this thing but this is just a name from a friend who have who is doing this kind of business and i love that and then i'll change the size to what 40 
pixels no 40 pixels to okay i'll have it like that but i'll change the font to a uh, bay bus and just a uh, bay bus new and i'll have it just like this and the next thing i have to do again is to come and copy the sleep dark green sleeve and then i'll pick that one too and then i'll just paste that one too over there and then that one i'll change the size to what to 60 and uh, i'll have just that one just like that and then the next thing i have to do again is that uh I'll change uh, those colors. I'll make some changes to the colors. So, but let's just keep working on the this thing. Let's just paste everything, and then I'll show you how to do. So, I'll just come and paste this one to, and then I'll put that one to, just like it in a paragraph way. Yes, and I'll have it like this. And I'll make the font size to be four, just like that. And then I'll change this the font to poppins. Yes, I love using poppins. Then I'll just try and drag. I'll just come and select it and then I'll drag it in just like that and then I'll make some distance to it by having it just like this and then I want my distance to be aligned so I'll introduce a guideline over here so that it will be aligned very well for me as I'm doing yes and the next thing I have to do again is to come and copy it, the location over here and then that particular location I'll just put that one to over here just like that and I'll have it just like this and then I'll make the size somewhere 12 somewhere 12 will be okay for me over there and I'll have it just like that and the next thing I have to do again is to come and copy it um, is to come and copy it by now and that one I can just introduce so that one would be just like a button and that one will be like that and I'll change the color to I like using love I like uh, using web colors then I'll have it just like this and I'll have it just like this and then I'll just paste my work by now over there okay and that one should be somewhere here and I'll change the color to what to black cause yellow can go with black it can yes and I'll have it just that one just like it and then let me just put up some space or oh, oh, sorry size of the distance 14 and I'll have it like this and then I'll just make changes to this particular distance so that it will look just like that okay yes and then you can see the composition is going so the next thing i have to do again let's check on that is all the this thing i have to do but the next thing i have to do is to add contact and then i'll call that one call call us and then i'll have it just like this and i will put zero five zero five five nine two two zero eight six eight Okay, and then I'll have a space just like that and then I'll just have it just like that and the next thing I have to do is to introduce some kind of uh, shape over there and then that particular shape should also go with the color over here which is yellow and then I'll have it like that and then the distance should go on top but for this one I'll just make it just like this and then I'll have it just like that okay and then this one i'll move my edges so that it will be a rounded shape like just like this and then i'll move this one just like that and i'll move this one somewhere like that okay and then i'll have it just like this you get that yes and then the color is changing i'll change this one to to the same yellow over there okay and this one should be black and this one should be changed to the same color over there just like that you get that yes and then uh, let me come and make some changes to the distance so that it will look so distant and i'm changing the the slay queen color and then i'll make that one bold yes and i'll have it just like that and it should be aligned and this one should be babies and this one all this is what babies 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 only this one is what poppins and i'll have that one just like that and the next thing that i have to do again is to go and import in one particular uh, this thing and that one should be social media handle and so that if uh, the person you can easily contact the person through the social media his social media handles and it's going to look so beautiful just like that okay yes and the next thing i have to do again is that i just want to introduce some line on top of the distance and and that line should look something uh, lovely and it's going to be a shape and i love that shape yes and this one i'll just move in the distance just like that then i'll change the color 
to the same yellow over here and then i'll have it just like that and but this one i'll move this one in up then i'll have it just like this you get that yes and then let me just make some adjustment to this one moving somewhere here and then have this one over there and then the next thing i have to do again is to come and draw some ellipse tool by going to rectangular market tool then i'll click i'll pick ellipse card tool then i'll just make some line over here, some shape circle line over there and then that one i'll move that one to the bottom and should be somewhere here and i'll change the color to this particular color over there just like that and then this particular distance i'll try and reduce the opacity to just like the 40 will be okay for me and should be somewhere here i love it that way yes and you can see the flow of my distance if i'm too fast you can tell me so that in the next tutorial i'll try and make some changes to my flow and so that i'll be somehow uh, 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 not speed up in my design but however i'm actually working on my distance and a whole lot of problems are going to run just around me yes so that is how we create a banner for a client maybe this is kind of a selling those kind of things fashion design this kind of things yes yes so that is how i design my distance and you can see that the composition is very easy and very 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 neat design yes thank you very much for watching this is abm graphics if you are new to this channel can you subscribe to the youtube channel like and share my video and if you are if you are already a subscriber please thank you very much for coming back may allah bless you have a nice day bye bye